That when Jesus came to earth, he came to die for all our sin. Porque todos, por naturaleza, sabemos que existe un Dios. Let's look at the word light for a minute. Verse 14, Jesus says, you are the light of the world. Look back in, back forward. In John 8, 12, Jesus calls himself the light of the world. We are the light of the world. Jesus is the light of the world. So we have the honor of being workers together with him in this calling to be light in the world. Interesting comparison, salt is something that's kind of hidden in how it works, but light works openly. Everyone sees the light. You won't see the salt once you sprinkle it on your fish. <clears throat> we are salt in our character. We are light in our message. In Genesis chapter 1, God's, God created light as the, the first thing in his creation. In the beginning, God created light, and what did he call it? He said, it is good. Light is good. So when we are light, we are doing a good thing. Why is light good? Well, among other reasons, it's a picture of spiritual light. It reveals truth and error. It exposes sin and darkness. Light makes observation and understanding possible, for the most part. It allows us to be witnesses of the wonder of God's creation. Because of light, we can see what God has done, and we can glorify Him because of it. And we are light in the world. The church is God's primary means of communicating the truth of the gospel in this age to this lost and dying world all around us. We do that in our homes. We do that in our neighborhood. And through missions, we do that in the world. He says we're like a city on a hill. A city on a hill can be seen by everyone around. And I assure you, they are watching. Jesus says, let your light so shine. That word so is critical. It doesn't just say let it shine. He says, let it so shine. The light is shining. It is being seen. Let it shine in such a way that they may see your good works. Let it shine so that there is a positive testimony and not a negative one. Uh, a week or so ago in the news, there was a negative example of a light, uh, of uh, a Christian light, if I could call it that. The son and successor of a well-known Christian university president behaved in a way that brought shame to the name of Christ. Do you think that the world wasn't watching? when that happened why was it so easy to find news stories about it anywhere you look the world is watching and to present us faultless before the presence of his glory with exceeding joy to the only wise god our savior glory majesty dominion and power